Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome to another video here on Sneaky Sasquatch. Today, what we're going to be doing, we're going to be continuing on trying to 100% the game. And the first thing we need to do is we need to run into town. Because there is a certain thing that I need to go do. And that certain thing involves going all the way over to the town hall, which is right here. And we are going to have to run all the way up to the third floor. And we need to check out some of the construction projects that we have around the city. Because we haven't actually really done any. The town planner. This is who we need to talk to. What I have discovered is we can actually name buildings. For example, if we take the diner here, we're going to go ahead and purchase this for 10000 as you can see, we can edit the text to be whatever we want. We could be uh, butter, you know, we could we could name it the butter restaurant. Now, because this is an option, what I want to do is basically get suggestions from you guys for what we should name the different buildings. So the first building we're going to be doing is the diner. So all you have to do is comment down below what you think we should name the diner and make sure to use the hashtag building name in your comment that way i can sort really easily and then i can see what people actually want this to be named so go ahead and leave a suggestion down below if you have one and who knows it might just end up in the world of sneaky sasquatch so with that out of the way the next thing we're going to be doing is going over to the museum because i need to check to see how many more dinosaur bones we actually have to get i have a few in my backpack i'm not exactly sure how many i have but we're going to go drop them off and we're gonna see how many more we actually need. All right, okay, we got four. Let's go ahead and add this up. Let's see how many more we actually need. Looking good, only five left. Okay, so we have five more to get. Let's run back to the house now, and let's pick up the dog. That way, if we ever run into a, an area or something, you know, then maybe he can find us another one, because that'd be great to finally complete that. All right, where's he at? He's over here, I think. Come here, buddy. Actually, I guess we should pet him first, and maybe feed him. He likes scratches. Likes lots of scratches. Oh my, uh, we have no food. Okay, well that's a problem. Well, let's go get him some food real quick. Before we go, let's check out the daily challenge board. So we have snowball fights time trial. And the record right now is 36 seconds. You know, I feel like we could probably get top five. I feel like we should probably check that out. So come on dog, let's go get you some food. And then I think we're going to go try and do the snowball fights. Uh, time trial because we just might be able to set a record. I, I kind of think we should be able to I don't think it's overly difficult. Yeah, I know you're hungry, buddy. That's that's why we're going We're gonna go get you some food. Hold on in to the pet shop. Uh, let's get some uh, should we get, we'll get some treats for him and Let's get some we can get a little bit of dog food. I guess all right I think this should probably be about enough. All right, let's check out the bet. Yep. Yeah, we got plenty of food Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go feed him a little bit and one final one. There you go, buddy. Good, good puppy dog. All right, let's get in the car and let's go up to the ski resort. Let's see if we can't beat these snowball trials. I feel like it's possible. But we got to go check it out first because I'm not exactly sure what it is, but I have an idea. Wait, hold up. Hold up. See, this is why we bring the dog. This is why we bring the dog. Look at him. Uh, preferably get off the street, buddy, because I... I uh, Kind of think that maybe, you know, it's not great to be... Yeah, that like that. You know, that's kind of close. He's tracking right now, okay? This is a good dog track. He, this is a good dog. He's doing the tracking. Look at him. I've never actually seen this happen before. I don't know why he's doing this. But this is impressive. Okay, okay. Ease back away from the road. Come come back over to... Oh, my goodness. Buddy, buddy, get off the road. You need to get off the road, man. Come on, buddy. Get off the road. Get off the road. Please. No! Oh, no! Good boy, Hunter. Ah, there he is. Hey, come here, buddy. Oh, he's a good little puppy dog. He's a good little puppy dog. All right, buddy. Let's go. No, don't do that. Don't. Come on, doggy. There you go. Are you ready to go get your thing? You ready to go? You can go scuba diving then. Come on, let's go. Oh, come on, puppy dog. Look at him go. Like he's got little flippers and everything. That's amazing. That is amazing. I like I like him.
He wasn't even phased. That's when you know you got a good hunting dog. He wasn't even phased by that. Got hit by a car. Still got his nose to the ground. Oh, he, he changed. Wait, hold up. Which way is he going? Oh, my goodness. Okay, nice. We're going over this way. All right, like, get off the road, buddy. Oh, it's over in that area. Okay, well, all right, let's come down this way. I think this will be faster. I guess let's uh, just kind of wade on through. Let's try, like, right here. This seems like a good spot. Let's go further. Okay, probably over here. Dude's, dude's just, like, sniffing through the, all the water and everything. It's kind of impressive. This little dog is good. Okay, right here is the last spot I can really think of. It's not here. I'm not sure where it is. Oh, you got to be kidding me. It's on the other side. Fine, we'll snorkel across. All right, puppy dog. Where is it at? Where did you say it was? It's right over here, maybe? Oh, we, f oh, we found it. Oh, well, that's impressive. That's a good dog right there. All right, we got us another dinosaur bone just like that. Man, that was, that was pretty easy. Where's my shoes at? Where's my shoes? I need my shoes. All right. Well, I guess we can actually just quickly run this back to the old museum guy. And uh, that way, we only have, what, four more to go. I hope they add more uh, things to the museum in the future. I really do. Be pretty neat. Looking good. Only four left. Only four more to go. What time is it? Six o'clock. Oh, well, you know what? I think we're going to have to go home. I think we're going to have to go home and sleep, and then we can uh, do the whole snowball thing in the morning. All right, before before we go to bed, let's make sure to load up his little bowl here with plenty of food. That way, you know, he's never hungry. Oh, it's, wow, food's falling all over the floor. Look at it, it's just crumbling down. Okay, come on, dog, we gotta go. Actually, you know what, let's not do that. Let's just teleport. That's easier. So let's run down and go enter into the snowball fight. I think I may potentially have to switch to a controller because for the snowball fights and stuff, it is so much easier on controller. Like, it is... It is insane how much of a difference it, uh, it is to use a controller with that stuff. Because it's just like, for me personally, like by hand, it's just really weird. So it's the, okay, so it's the time trial, I believe. So hit all the targets before the time runs out. Okay, well, let's try it by, let's try it just by like doing this. Okay, yeah, see, this is like, I don't, I don't like this. We're going to definitely need to switch to a controller. Yeah, you can definitely aim a whole lot better, though, with the controller. And that's what I'm looking for. So, yeah. It took us a minute and 15 seconds. That's not good. So, let me quickly hook up a controller. And uh, we're going to try this again. Now we got this. This is going to be kind of weird, though. What the world did I just do? I think I ran into it too hard. <laughs> okay, this is so weird, though, with the little doing that. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. Okay, so it's just like, okay, it's just a, yeah, that's what it is. Okay, it's a whole lot easier this way. Yeah, there we go. All right, run, buddy. We got to go. Where's this next person? Oh, I was right here. There, we got him that time. Okay, so the next person's in there. Quickly run up here, because I know there's a guy up here. Got that one. Okay. Got that one. Got that one. I just gotta quickly run inside. And get this one. And just miss like crazy. There we go. We got it within... So we got it... We need to pick it up by 14 seconds. Uh, that wasn't that wasn't too bad. We got it within 50 seconds, but we're gonna need to run at least. I think is at least we got to get it within at least 40 seconds to actually have a top five time. But we need to we need to work on that. Run here now. We're gonna run back out. Not that one. Run over here. Not that one. Run here. Got that one. Well, this is actually looking pretty good. Got that one. Oh, there we go. Well, that was like 30, 38 seconds. That's pretty good. Okay, that's good. That is, that is a good contending time right there. Okay, we're going to try it again. We're getting better. We're getting better. Okay, so I think we, yeah, we go for this guy. Run up, forward. Run over this way. Pick this dude off. Run inside here. Here. Get that one. 
Get that one. Get that one. All right, here you go, go, go. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure. That's kind of impressive how they were able to do it that fast. Okay, we beat our time by a little bit, but I think we need a better... We need to run a different route, I think. Here's an idea. What if we run up here first? Get that one. Oh, wait, hold up. I think we found a new strategy here. So if we catch the guy before he walks up, we can actually get a faster time. Okay, this is good. This is good. So let's quickly go to sleep. And then we'll be back in the morning. So now that we've found that out, I definitely think it's possible to get a faster time. The only, the one thing is I missed that one shot, which kind of screwed some things up. Yes. Okay, let's get over to the time trial. Here we go. All right. New day. Let's try this again. We got to get this guy first. Okay, that's about the same as the last one. We missed that that one shot though and hit the tree. Uh and I was I was a little too far away. So we need to kind of pick the pace up on that one a little bit. We're getting it. We're getting faster. We're getting faster. We're understanding the layout now. Straight down. Straight back out. Come straight over. Get him there. Keep running until this guy. Get him there. Get him there. Why does it keep auto correcting and missing? Yes! 2614! Oh my goodness! I'm pretty sure that's actually the record. I'm like 90% sure that's it. Let's go! We got first 3385. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. What time is it? 5.30. Okay, I'm going to go to sleep. I want to go check the actual records because I'm curious actually how good that is. Okay, let's check these out. Uh, daily records. Well, I know we have the day daily records in... Uh, is it miscellaneous? Is that where it's at? Food eaten... Snowball fights time trial. Here we go. Oh my goodness, we're first. Let's go. That's in the daily records. Let's look at the weekly records. Uh, miscellaneous. Snowball fights time trial. Oh my goodness, we're at the top in that as well. Okay, now let's look at all time. This is where it comes down. Are we the all time record holder of Snowball fights time trial? Oh no, someone beat it in 29 seconds. It's still cool that we're, we're top 11, which is pretty, pretty neat. Anyways, I want to thank you all so much for watching this video. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. And if you really enjoyed, maybe even hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to leave your name suggestions down below for the buildings. I'll see you all in the next one.